Hello people and welcome to um, the EASUS um, Partition Master 3.5 Server Edition Review. We made a little video of this because, um, well, this is the, the boot disk that we actually created. We found out that it's using Grub, which is usually a Linux boot manager. So we're just going to see what happens, what it's good for. There we go, we selected the CD-ROM. It's going to boot from the CD-DVD. There we go. It's all pretty fast. It's good. We don't know exactly what to expect because, um, well, the program itself is not very clear about it. And there we go, it's an EASIS program, as it seems. It's about 50 megabytes large, so it should be packed with at least some features if it's an MS-DOS program, because those are usually not too large. There we go. We got an option to select our video driver here. As you can see, there's some standard Modi uh, supported, and we'll just pick the default video driver, the recommend one. There we go. See what happens. There we go. This looks very, very, very much Linux alike. I got no clue what's written there. It's very unclear. Nah, uh, you can't read that. Um, Alright, this is just a general warning that we should not resize or delete or whatever our Windows Vista, Windows 2008 partitions, and we should not mess around with any other Windows partitions either, as it seems. And we should not be messing around with RAID. Alright. Whoa, that's quite a lot of information right there. Well, we're back at the EASIS Partition Master Server Edition. And this is actually exactly the program that we used before. As you can see, we have the 100 megabytes of an allocated space here. And basically, it's just a low resolution version which allows us to do just about anything we like, I expect. Here we go. That's it. We'll pick advanced here. If I can see anything that I'm doing. And we can do anything here. Let's just create a new. Yeah. Alright. Well, we'll just make a new NTFS uh, partition. As can be seen here. Logical one. Simple as can be. Let's just see if this boot disk works. If it does, then we're going to be all happy. There we go. Hitting apply. Now you can see the master at work. Partition master. <laughs> Whatever. Alright, one operation is currently pending. Apply changes. Yes, go ahead. There she goes. Well, that was rather fast. It's done already. Well, it seems like it's a useful program. Actually, it's faster than in Windows itself, and it seems to be very useful. Uh, for just about anyone who wants to play around with his uh, Windows alike uh, partitions. Not to mention you can't do anything with Linux partitions with the Asus Partition Master Server Edition 3.5. Thank you for watching and thank you for reading.